All right, to get started, I just added a video clip to my timeline that I'd like to add a shake effect to. Let's begin by going up here to the Effects tab. Then open up Filters from the side menu. Now go ahead and select the Shake category to see eight different shake effects. To preview one, just double click it anywhere but on the plus sign. Once you find one you like, just click the plus sign in the middle to add it to your timeline. Okay, there we have our shake effect, but you might want to change where it plays back in your video. To do that, move the playhead to where you want your shake effect to start. Then drag your shake effect to that position. Next, move the playhead to where you want your shake effect to end. This time, drag the ending edge of your clip to adjust its duration to the playhead's position. Alright, this is looking good, but before I go, I want to show you how to change up your shake effect a bit. To do this, double click your shake effect on the timeline to open up its settings. The first thing you can do is toggle off the RGB split if you don't like it, but I actually think it looks really cool. You can also change the frequency of your shakes, which will change how big they are. And lastly, you can adjust the position or direction your shake goes. So if I wanted it to be more of a sideways shake, I could increase the position X. Alright, and that's all from me. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.